everyone, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so I just did a video talking about regrets and one of the things that I regretted was a bag that I bought that I sold to Fashion File. So, I did say that I will do a video talking about selling it, but I have to say, I took the credit option because it was such a smarter option and I turned around and I got something. I have been wanting this for a really long time, so yeah, this isn't, it, well, it's not, I was going to say, it's not quite an unboxing. It's not an unboxing. I opened it when it got here. I had a really long day. It came at the end of the day. I also had uh, Zayla's baseball game to go to. It's just a long story, so I opened it. But anyway, it still looks like I didn't open it, so, but the bag's not in here. I have it sitting over here, but I'm going to just show you how it came. So for those of you that haven't bought from Fashion File, you can see it. I know most of you have seen enough of these videos, so I don't want to do too much of it. But anyway, it came like this. I had, actually haven't opened this thing yet, but this is like the card that inside of it will have your receipts and you know, it's got a thank you to tag them, stuff like that. That's all in there. Um, then you get a file and it's still the same. I like my menu where I can see it hanging in my closet, fashion file. Weirdly enough, I know a file is just a file, but I feel like they have the best files. And now that I get my nails done and the dip powder and whenever I need to shorten them, these work so good. Like I bought some from the store. They wear out too quick with those last. Anyway. All right. And it says used is the new new. This one did not have any of the confetti. So that's pretty cool. Like I didn't have to worry about, you know, the confetti's fun and cool to look at, but I didn't have to worry about getting it everywhere. So anyway, open it up and there was a dust bag. It came in a fashion file dust bag, um, but it also did come with its own dust bag. So this is the dust bag that it came with. So you do know it's Louis Vuitton. And this is one of the old school dust bags. I only have one of these. They did these for a pretty long time. So I think the first Louis Vuitton that I got, my um, Speedy 25, came in one like this. Although it came in a really, really small one that would only fit it if it was folded, in, folded up. Anyway, whenever I gave my mom my uh, mini looping, I gave her that dust bag. But anyway, so yeah, it came with its dust bag and I'm excited to have one of these again. Are you guys ready for this? I am so, I'm back up, so excited. Okay. I got a No Way GM. Okay. <laughs> I have to tell you the story about how I got this and I'm going to show you close ups and tell you everything about it. Um, so, like I said on my last video, if you didn't watch like my regrets video, like on stuff I bought, sold, stuff like that, let me just tell you really quick. There was a bag that I had wanted. No, not that I had wanted. I had been looking on the new arrivals and refreshing, and this bag came up. And I mean, immediately it was sold. So, <laughs> okay. I got the credit from Fashion File for selling them a bag. And before the, so you, you sell them stuff and then they receive it. Once they receive it, they have to authenticate it and then you get the credit. So as I was waiting, like after I mailed it off, I knew that I was going to want to try to find a GM. Cause I was like, even if, you know, I have to pay a little bit, it's still like getting a discount because I will have a credit. And as I was waiting, I swear I found like five or more that were in perfect condition. I think I even talked about it in one of my videos about just how before I even sold that bag to Fashion File, I was like, I found a really, really good one and I just didn't buy it. So anyway, as I'm waiting, I had so many on my wish list. I'm just watching them sell. I was like, oh my God, if it would just hurry up. There was even this little uh, Palas beauty bag that came up for like 650 they're over a thousand dollars new and this one is a new condition i'm like what is all this stuff popping up like this for that i can't get yet because i didn't want to just buy something like i told you guys i wasn't going to just buy something and i'm trying really hard not to so anyway i got the credit and i'm just like oh my god and i keep telling like two of my friends amy and miranda like stuff that kept coming up and i think i was telling jess too from she's a posh and um like they were it's kind of like amy especially was like no don't do it. You want the no way. Don't buy it. You're going to regret it. So, like I kept listening to her and ugh, I swear. But anyway, I get the credit and all those bags are gone. Everything, everything that I really, really wanted is gone. I'm like, are you kidding me? Days go by and nothing. Like the only things that would pop up were like terrible, terrible condition. I'm like, no, no, I just can't buy it like that. Like I can't. And I even showed my husband and he was just, no. So anyway, 
this one came up and the way that it came up was so like ugh. it was like getting this was almost like trying to get a ps5 like which i still can't get for my husband they pop up we put them in our cart and then they're gone so anyway i was on the phone with fashion file asking about one of the delightfuls of the Peabone interior like at the the personal shopper was like looking and she was telling me like all the um like the actual condition in real in person and stuff like that and it was great and then we she was gonna send me more pictures so we hang up the phone and I hit refresh and this pops up and I was like oh my god oh my god no way perfect condition put it in my cart and I go um to check out and guess what it sold like seriously it just popped up and it sold that quick so someone else was doing it I was doing it. I was like oh no 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 but I was persistent and I just kept hitting it and it's like maybe the person's card didn't go through maybe they entered something incorrectly but it came back up went in my cart and I was able to get it oh my god <laughs> I'm telling you it's just crazy so anyway this one is from I think 2012 the date code is AR3102 so it's the 30th week of 2012 so yeah and it's in perfect condition like look at this i do have to say though <laughs> um i got uh wear on it yesterday because zayla had a double header and yeah i got i wore jeans and i got color transfer so just fyi it's not from how it looked um that's what i did so anyway like i just want to show you guys like how good does this look they already had the knots on the end, but I did my tie at the top. Oh, it's just beautiful. Like, look at this condition. Like, look at this. It looks so good. Now wait till you see the bottom. Like, talk about perfect. Absolutely freaking perfect. So many that I saw had lines going this way, almost like someone took water and just dribbled it down. Like, I don't know what happened, but it's perfect. And of course, it's made in France. Um, I don't want to say 100% of them are made in France, but it's really rare to find one made somewhere else. There are very few that say made in the USA. I kind of wonder if those are like repaired or something. I don't know, but yeah. Um, I did get color transfer on it for my jeans right there. Uh, the strap is absolutely perfect. You guys, like the top is light. It's Whoever had it just didn't use it much. So it's as easy as that. Um, the hardware is perfect. Like here's just, you know, a close look. Like, how good is this? I'm just like so excited, I can't even describe. Um, it still has the D-ring. If you go back too far, they won't have the D-ring. But yeah, and it's perfect. And inside, of course, I have all my crap already, because like I said, I'm already using it. But yeah, I'm so excited. I'm gonna have to do a review on this and show you guys some mod shots and everything because it definitely fits and lays against my body different than a petite noe does. <sighs> yes, I am so excited. Fashion file for the win. That way I didn't have to pay, you know, $17.60 for that new. That's pretty much like, <sighs> that's an amazing condition. Like, I am like over the moon about finding that. I do want to throw this in really quick. I got this really cute shirt for my friend Jess from She's the Posh. Um, she's making her own merch and I think that's so much fun for her um but she sent me this she's changing this a little bit oh you can't see that she's changing this a little bit because the she's the is just a little bit too dark on this color but it says she's the posh right here and she's got her little her whole logo there and it's so cute and then the back you guys it says I want to age like a Louis Vuitton like how cute is that I thought this was like the cutest thing and I got it in a size medium because I wanted it to be like a little bit big, but it's not like unflattering big. And I got long sleeves uh, and I love it. She's got it in different colors. She's like coming out with other merch. She's got like water bottles, um, sweatpants, sweaters. Like it's just so cute. And uh, she's just got some really good ideas and I just love her stuff. And I just, she's such a good person. So anyway, I just wanted to show you guys this really cool shirt that I got from her. Cause I'm wearing it today anyway. <laughs> so yes. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye. I'm not ready for darkness. I'm not ready